How does the Catholic Church, one of the world's oldest institutions, spread its message in the digital age? With more people turning to online sources for information, the Church is now taking a fresh approach to spreading the gospel of Jesus Christ. I'm Matt Gambino of CatholicPhilly.com, and I recently met with Father Tom Daly of St. Charles Borromeo Seminary to learn more about how the Church is sharing the Catholic faith in the age of Facebook and social media. Father Daly has been named the Cardinal Foley Chair of Homiletics and Social Communications at St. Charles, a faculty position that he himself helped to create. I hope you can explain a little bit about how the Cardinal Foley chair uh, is now a permanent chair. Talk a little bit about the chair and your role in it now. Sure. It was back in 2013, the 2013-2014 academic year that, that the chair was uh, inaugurated. I helped to create the, the position in terms of trying to um, raise the profile of communications in the seminary education. So we began with a lecture series uh, with particular workshops and events. Now, a couple years later, uh, I have the honor of uh, coming back full-time to the seminary to kind of launch the chair into its full-time mode, which would, be, which would include teaching, uh, teaching the seminarians, developing a program or programs for communicating the importance of communications uh, to various groups and uh, in the diocese and beyond the diocese, um, also to look at the whole the, the whole curriculum of communications here at the seminary and see what what maybe we can improve upon for the future pastors of the church. It sounds like communications is becoming a more prominent part of the program of formation. Most definitely, um, I, I, I believe it is, and I believe it needs to be um, um, making that intentional seeing the importance of that and also adapting it to today's mode of communications I think is something that uh, that is worth teaching and, and worth speaking about, uh, not just for the seminarians, but for the entire church. More and more seminarians are digital natives. They've grown up with digital technology and are used to communicating through text messages, emails, and social media platforms. That's important to consider when training seminarians in homiletics, that is, how to preach a homily, at mass. The inclusion of homiletics in the position of the chair um, attests to the fact that that's the basic communication ever since the beginning of the church is preaching. Um, so uh, what my task will be is to look at the, the classes that are taught, the, the, the way homiletics is taught, to try to um, share 30 years of experience uh, with the seminarians in terms of their preaching. But the, 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 to me, the interesting fact is those two topics are combined. That is to say, you know, preaching has to take into account that you're now preaching to a congregation who is used to being communicated to digitally. Mm -hmm. So how, do, how, how are they going to mesh? How are, the, how are those forms going to clash? What do I, as a, as a public speaker, have to realize when my audience or congregation is used to getting information on screens. Um, so there, there's all kinds of interesting uh, angles to consider, uh, but again, it comes down to the, the, the fundamental fact that preaching is communicating and it's communicating the gospel. To prepare them to communicate with their future congregations, Father Daly asks his students to think about how they themselves process news and information in the digital age. And so I think the, not the trick, but the method to, to teaching them this is to get them to look at themselves. Uh, if, if, if how they hear news and information is digitally, then how are they going to take that experience and let it inform how they preach and how they teach and how they how they work in the parish and how the parish itself communicates with folks um, I, I think there's a whole um, there's a whole realm of work right there just just parish communications or, uh... father Daly points out that the digital revolution is challenging the church at all levels to rethink how it spreads the good news communications is covering everything we do in the church so how are we going to get all of those things working on the same page